Hi everyone. How are you guys doing? Okay, all right. Welcome to this uh, special webinar today, and glad to see you guys again here in this uh, such a late uh, notice. Thanks you guys for joining us here today. And okay, first just do a round check here. Can you hear my voice clearly now? Yeah, if you can hear my voice clearly, type the word uh, uh, yes in the chat box right now so I can know uh, that you can hear my voice. Okay, let me see the comment box. By the way, uh, this is uh, this platform here is different from Zoom a little bit. You can access this through your browser. And if you can actually uh, hear, okay, I see a lot of yeses here. So it's great. So I assume that the video is great and uh, uh, the, the voice is great as well. Great. Okay, so now uh, let me do a proper uh, greeting here to all of you as an appreciation. Welcome for uh, today, uh, this special webinar, where we're going to talk about money and you, according to Patsa. All right. And is uh, is if you follow me for quite some time, yeah, one of my favorite topic is about wealth, about money. Is it the same for you as well? Right. So if you are, then you're in the right webinar today. Okay, and uh, why we're we doing this because uh, I received a lot of requests from uh, uh, our Telegram uh, subscribers, our tribe members there, you know, asking me to do a live session to share with you more information. So, and uh, because uh, the previous one I did in an in person event, and this, if you are living overseas or outside of Malaysia, probably you're finding a bit hard to attend those events. So, there's one of the reasons I'm doing this live event right early in October. Okay, so as a form of actually giving back some uh, uh, some knowledge, some sharing here, and hope you find a lot of enjoyment yeah, in practicing Chinese metaphysics. Okay, so and we have a different group here, of course, today. Some of you here are very new to Chinese metaphysics, yet some of you here are seasoned practitioner, right? So no matter where uh, or, or which level you're in, in uh, metaphysics is fine. Right, because today is our, I'm talking to everyone, everyone can benefit from this. And first of all, yeah, let's, since we have a chat room here, you can actually chat with me and can chat with each other here. Why not you just introduce yourself with all the participants here today uh, about where you're from, right? Type in the country where you're from in the chat box right now so I can see and so the rest of the attendees as well. Okay, type it in the chat box right now, which country you're from, okay. Let me take a look. Okay. All right. I see Malaysia here. I see Singapore. All right. Nice. Denmark. Okay. Canada. Holland. Okay. Dorothy from, wow, so fast. Okay. Great, great. So Stephanie, Singapore. Okay. It's too fast. I can I can actually follow each of it. I just try to read. Okay. I saw Ingrid, uh, Penang, Singapore. Okay. Spain. All right, Mexico, all right, nice. Singapore, Malaysia, Netherlands, Australia, UK, okay, USA. Wow, no matter where you are, thank you. So uh, I would like to say good morning, good afternoon, good evening to all of you here because all of you here in different time zone right now. I, I think that technology is such amazing nowadays. I can actually talk to everyone here from different time zones at the same time, right? And you can watch this right at the comfort from your own home. So if you are... Oh, I see Lamadan, Philippines, Indonesia. Great, great. Thanks. Yeah, first of all, I, I would like to thank all of you here for actually spending your time. And I'm going to make your time worthwhile. How about that? I know it's not easy, right? Some of you wake up very early in the morning or some of you stay very late at night. No matter where you are, I'm going to make your time worthwhile of probably two hours here. So I, I, I prepare a lot of contents here. Okay, most of the time, if you follow me for quite some time, I actually over prepared a lot of contents, right? So depends, depends on the tempo later on. So if the if the thing moving on smoothly, you can get more information, right? And do you have time here, like one or two hours? So, so it's a very important time. Work can wait. Okay, <laughs> tell your boss I can wait because what the, what the one of the important thing in today's webinar here is I'm going to share some uh, life-changing information okay and i hope that can benefit all of you here as well and now if you are new to this if you are new to this probably the first time you are seeing me then let me just do a brief introduction about myself my name is iverson lee i'm from joe yap consulting group 
And um, what I do on a daily basis, I use Chinese metaphysics system such as Bazi, Feng Shui, Qi Men Dun Jia, and multiple subjects. And I use this to help people to transform their life. Okay, I do it in both ways. I, I do some consultation. I also teach this subject. So is, if you ask me what kind of role I'm playing here, I'm more like a transformation coach. I would like to see myself that way. A lot of people say, I was like, are you a success coach or a transformation coach? Is it the same thing? Actually, it's not. Success coach basically that teach you how to do something, right? They guide you on something uh, that is success coach, but you still dependent on them. Where else transformation coach is I, the way I share information is you become the new person, right? You internalize it so you don't depend on me. Okay, so I'm there just to uh, work with you for quite a few times. And then once you instill those habit, those mindset, then yeah, you're, you're independent, right? You can actually create something. You don't need me yeah, in the process of actually getting what you want. So I'll, I'll be on the first or first or two session here to guide you. How about that, right? Instead of giving you the fish, yeah, I, I teach you how to fish. Yeah, that is always my style of actually teaching people, right? So I, I feel that the way I do this, I can benefit more people at the same time, right? Because I don't make people dependent on me, right? Because whatever you achieve in your life is you, yeah, it's due to your credit. So I hope that I play a role in part of your life that can help you make some important shift in your life, no matter what is your goal is or what kind of problems you want to solve. I would say that metaphysics can find a way to help you to, um, to lead you to the right direction. Yeah, this is what I I do here. So, and um, how do I get started in this journey? I uh, if you if one of your favorite topic is about uh, I would say uh, wealth related topics. So why I so uh, actually uh, or maybe I'm so into this wealth here is because I if you look back in my life in the last uh, maybe the last how many years or seven years ago. Right, so I'm struggling financially. So I know how it feels. How many of you here right now? You're not doing so well in the uh, finance department right now. Okay, how many of you? Okay, type the word me. Okay, so if you are on that state right now, I feel you because I've been there. Yeah, it doesn't feel good, of course. Right. So and and from there, I actually uh, came across uh, certain uh, subjects uh, in Chinese metaphysics. Yeah, that I use it and I able to actually make use of certain strategy that I I learned from a Pazi chart or the Feng Shui and Qi Men to help me to get myself out of the rut and um, and to move ahead, right? So and what do I what do I mean here is like this because yeah in um, in Chinese metaphysics uh, in uh, seven years ago when I start to learn this I'm 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 in huge in that. All right, creditors are calling. I don't know what to do, and then I I try to find so many ways uh, to help me to get out of it. And one of the things I'm going to share with you today is my I would say the catalyst of change. Yeah, and I and it's not something hard to do, uh, but it's something easy to do. Yeah, but the problem is when something is easy to do, it's also easy not to do. Agree, guys? <laughs> yeah, that is the irony, right, of everything. Right, so if something is too easy, means you're so easy not to do. So today I'm going to show you the techniques, but whether you want to do it or not, it's up to you. Okay, so so if you just want to listen, it's fine. So how I'm going to structure today um, our webinar here is I I'm going to show you how do I use a Pazi. Pazi is is Chinese astrology system that I use for myself to get myself out of the financial uh, issues. So, and it told me, I know some of you might think, right? How, how do you get out of it? How, how long is it? Is it like 10 years, a decade? So, or, or one year? So I'm not that smart, by the way. <laughs> yeah, one year is not enough for me. So it took me, because that time I'm heavily in debt and then I, 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 I don't have money basically. And it took me two years, seven months. I still remember. Uh, to actually tra transform my finance um, in my finance department. I, it took me like two two years and seven months to make my first million. Okay, some of you might think it's too long, right? Two and a seven, two years and a seven months, but maybe you, are, you can do it always better. Some people do it within months, 
right? For me, I'm heavily in debt and then able to convert and turn around my financial uh, state here. It took me two years and seven months. How many of you here want to learn this? Yeah, want to learn, want to learn this part here. How do I use Sparta to help me to get ahead in life? Okay, it feels good, right? When you're able to control your life in terms of uh, uh, financially. So you want to learn this, type the word me in the chat box right now. I'm glad to share with you. Okay, great. Wow, so many of you here today that are showing up. Okay, so, and how do we do this here? First of all, you need to get your partner chart ready. <laughs> so today, as the name imply, uh, it's a title implied here is money and you according to your partner, right? So, and some of you are new here, probably you don't know what is this partner is. So let me show you the link first, right? The link, how to get it. So uh, there you go. Oh, okay, so let me show you this. Okay, that this is the one, right? So if you don't have the chart yet, yeah, this is the chart I use, right? When how if you ask me what what system I use to help me to build my wealth foundation, yeah, there you go. This is the one, joyab.com slash bz chart. Right? This is a free link. Uh, all you need to do is just log in through your smartphone or any electronic devices. And it's free, by the way. You just key in your date of birth and time of birth, and boom, there you go, right? You got your chart here. So, and I think most of you already have this. If you, if you don't, uh, pay attention to the chat box. I think the team here, Ocean, okay, there's a, uh, he, she actually typed in the uh, joyab.com BZ chart here. You just click on the link and get your chart ready. This is important because if you don't have the chart uh, ready, then uh, you, you might not able to actually follow or benefit from this uh, session here. And now, some of you here are very new to this, right? You might be wondering, we are able to benefit from this session, of course, right? So today is all about focus on application. So now, are you guys ready to have the butter chart? Okay, so now the next question here is, what is this chart is, right? Yeah, it seems like a lot of information. It seems like impressive, but how uh, can this information help me? So the butter chart is like a live user manual, right? All of us here, uh, the moment we are born, do we are uh, got handed with a user manual? No, <laughs> we are born and then we learn life along the way. Would it be cool that all of us here actually, uh, when we are born, it comes with a live user manual. So we know exactly what is our potential, our strengths, our weaknesses, and what are the opportunities av available in life? Who can help us or what kind of uh, uh, chances you can take? to take your life to the next level. Right? Would it be cool if you have this information uh, while you are, uh, when you are young, so you have more time to make changes? Yeah, so this is exactly this uh, part of Charlotte's. And so I'll call this a live user manual. And how this uh, chart that can help me, if you know how to read the chart, then there's so many ways it can help you. So let me show you the, uh, the impact or the will of destiny how can you actually make use of this information? Okay, so I'll call this, this is the will of our uh, uh, destiny. Okay, so basically there are eight area. Yeah, you can use this sponsor chart for. So uh, of course, we can, you can actually use it for health. How many of you here think your health is your wealth? Of course, right? If you don't have health, yeah, nothing else matter, agree? Right, if you don't have energy, right, no matter how passionate you are in your relationship, how much money you have, or how great your relationship is, you're not going to enjoy it. Okay, so and then the other part is, is about you can use the partner to look at your family, right, your family relationship, and how you improve it is on the family matters as well. So and the another area which we're going to focus a lot today would be on the wealth segment, right, if you look at the view of destiny, the wealth segment is also one of the area you can actually uh, look for more information about the wealth part. Okay, and of course the social part is networking because we are not alone in this planet, right? All of us here, uh, we want to create success. We need help from other people. So the social yeah, aspect in your life is extremely important. And also, Pata can also talk about spirituality as well. How many of you here actually uh, agree that spirituality development is also important. It's not about just achieving. It's also about fulfillment and wisdom. 
right? Yeah, no matter how much you are, you are able to achieve, if you're not happy, right, your life will be miserable, right? So I think that this is also one of the area that's really important, especially in period nine. And how about love? How many of you here like to learn the love aspect from Pata? Although I didn't talk about love a lot, okay? Yeah, but is but nevertheless, is uh, one of the important core of you, all of us here. I always believe that the, the quality of our life is the direct reflection of the quality of our relationship, isn't it? Right, so, and how about creativity, right? How do you explore uh, or express yourself in terms of your work, your masterpiece, right? Uh, so this is something, right? So we have to have certain, we have all of us here, we will be happy when we have certain capability, right? Where we can express uh, ourselves better. And finally here, the, uh, the other aspect here is career and business. Right, so do you able to actually uh, discover what are your talent and your strength so you can add more value, be it in your career or in the business? Okay, so now, of course, your partner can cover so many things and we have two hours here. Today, we're going to talk about one aspect, the wealth aspect here. How many of you here want to learn this part? Okay, and of course, when we have time, we can actually do something about other aspects like health, family, uh, and other things. I'm not saying wealth is the, mo is the only thing here, but today I chose to talk about uh, uh, the wealth here. Okay, so now, why? Why, why among all these topics, I choose uh, the wealth topic here? Because I discovered uh, one thing, right? I discovered one thing is uh, uh, now every day is so expensive, right? all the goods if you shop in in a grocery store or even you go out for uh, uh, uh in, to eat in a restaurant so do you realize that everything is so expensive right now right that's why they call this what inflation all right don't you think it's a it's a real problem right now yeah and you see that the economy actually slowed down a lot so and i discovered that you know yes we cannot control inflation but i think the best way to protect against inflation is to increase our earning power right that's the only way right we cannot control the economy but the way to beat inflation yeah if we can expand or 10x our earning power yeah that's the best protection against inflation yeah so the next question here is how to do this right so and why I choose this topic is because of this and I also believe that wealth is the catalyst for change yeah, in especially when we talk about astrology or Chinese metaphysics uh, people keep talking about changing destiny right so then the next question here is what is the catalyst for change right if you have more money don't you think it will improve the all the aspect of your life as well agree are right, going to uh, impact and affect all the rest of remember the the view of destiny we talked about just now right going to affect every single one so if, even about your health right some people say money cannot buy health yes i agree with that in a way but if you are not well if you want to go uh, to seek treatment don't you think when you have enough money or uh, uh, resources don't you think you can get access to the best doctor in the world and the chances of uh treat your whatever disease you have will be higher right so if you don't have these resources you need to queue up like everyone else right sometimes you might not even able to wait because the queue is too long right so i would say there are so many ways you can benefit from it so basically when you have more wealth you have more freedom to choose something you can choose when to go to work agree because you don't work for money anymore right you can choose where to go for holiday with who there are so many options here. Yeah, I think life is too short just to spend our life just working, right? We should actually enjoy our life. So therefore, this is the one here. So today, I'm going to talk about how do you actually decode. Yeah, so I use the word decode because the part of the chart, there's a lot of code inside, right? How do you decode um, the wealth aspect from your part of? Yeah, this is our main focus today. I know that there's so many aspects you want me to talk about, but today, let's focus here. We're going to talk about wealth okay so here i prepared in in a in a module so there are each module here uh, where i'm going to share with you certain techniques or certain uh, methods of deriving uh, certain wealth information from your chart so let's go through 
um, the first uh, module or the first topic. Okay, let me show you first. Okay, all right. There you go. So in the first thing I'm going to talk about today, right, is your wealth energy pattern. Okay, this is the one I'm going to talk about. Why, why this is, our, our, is a pattern here? Because everything in life is energy, right? If, uh, if you want to make more money, uh, there's a certain frequency we need to tune, uh, a certain energy frequency that actually to match the amount you want to make, right? So if you're able to actually reach to the level as your frequency with the money going to make, and then you're able to attract yeah, uh, wealth to you, right? So that's why all form of wealth is a form of energy. It's a form of energy exchange. And in your butter chart, right, you can actually uh, track or measure this uh, wealth energy in your chart. So if your wealth energy is strong, then you, you're able to actually uh, find more ways to create more wealth. You can attract more opportunities and you know what to do with it. Is it cool? How many of you here want a good quality of uh, wealth energy? Yeah, say I. Yeah, say the, uh, type the word me in the chat box. How many of you want to have a positive and um, high quality wealth energy? Yeah, if your energy is low, then that's when you lose money, right? And then everything is get hot. So I'm going to talk about this uh, energy pattern here. So are you guys ready? Are you guys ready to learn this? Okay, now let me show you. Uh, now, first of all, take out your butter chart. Yeah, take out your butter chart. And now let me uh, tell you, if you want to track for the wealth energy, you need to look at these two elements, okay, as shown on the screen right now. So if you see, there are two uh, things here. One is DW and then one is IW, right? So DW stand for direct wealth and the DW stand for uh, indirect wealth. So it's a short form. Okay, so and now remember this DW and IW, I want you to locate yeah, this element in your parts chart. Okay, take out your parts chart. So now I'm going to show you how to do this. Okay, all right. So let me show, bring a sample chart. Okay, can you see the sample chart on the screen right now? Okay, so this is uh, where, where you want to look for this information is uh, very simple. I want you to look at, let me see whether I can draw something. Okay, all right. So I want you to just zoom in here. Okay, and then I want you to look at only this portion. All right, only this portion, only this segment. I, I have to be clear here. Only this uh, segment here. And what you need to do yeah, is to actually look at, you zoom in zoom in here okay some of you say it's blur is it better now right you zoom in so roughly you can see the the section here and what i want you to locate is the iw or dw in the chart because these two elements governs your wealth energy in your butter okay so now where do you look for this inside here first of all i want you to look at this area Okay, this is the first uh, part here. You want to actually look for it. And if you cannot look for, uh, if you're not able to locate this here, then at least, do you find anything at this part or not? Okay, so do you see it? So now look for it, either IW or DW first. Yeah, check. So let me uh, let me repeat this again. So where do you look for this? So the uh, you can look for this element here. There are three uh, circle. This is where you can look for it. If you have found one, then it's great. So if you don't have it, then you can look at the bottom part, this whole stretch here. Do you see any IW or DW? For example, if I look at here, I can see on top, I don't have it, right? You see on top, I don't have this. But at the bottom, at the bottom here, do you see an IW here? Okay, I have one here. And then do you see another one? IW? Yes, of course. And how about here? Wow, this person have three. 
Okay, now it's your turn. It's your turn. Okay, it doesn't matter where it is, and as long as it belongs to the region that I show you just now, do you have it or not? Right? Some of you have IW and DW together, it's fine. Some of you have only IW, it's cool as well. If some of you have DW only, it's fine. Doesn't matter. Right? Either one or even combination is fine, or the mixture of both. So now type in the chat box right now. Uh, do you have it or not? Very simple. Yes or no? Yeah, where is it? I don't care yet. <laughs> okay, so I know some of you say it's in the hidden stem or the year pillar. Yeah, it doesn't matter. Now is whether you have it or not. Okay, how much doesn't mean anything for now. Okay, all right. So, okay, wow, so many of you here have this. Okay, I also see some of you don't have it. Doesn't, don't, don't worry yet, okay? Yeah, delay your sadness first. Yeah, pay attention to what I'm going to say right now first. Okay, so now, if if you have, what does it mean, right? So, and if you have this uh, wealth element in your chart, either IW or DW, I would like to say uh, you have the energy, wealth energy within you. Right? As long as you have the wealth energy within you, yeah, the chances of you to making money yeah, is, 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 is better than those people that don't have it. Okay, so let me tell you what it means if you have the wealth element in your chart. Yeah, there are three things. So uh, one, uh, the first thing here is if you have the wealth element in your chart, uh, it means that uh, you, you're able to recognize wealth opportunities easier than other people. Don't you think it's cool? Right, because opportunity is everywhere. Yeah, the question here is, do you able to spot one or not? So if you have wealth element, you're able to see uh, wealth opportunities around you, able to see the gap in the market, right? You're able, to, you're able to see what people need right now. Okay, so you're good at that. Yeah, so I say you're good in spotting opportunities. Is this important? Yes, it is. Okay, so now the second one, if you have wealth element in your chart, right? So it also means that wealth is important to you right because if it's not important you're not going to waste a lot of time to make the money agree or not guys right sometimes people don't make money because it's not the one of the most important thing yeah they have it if they have it then it's fine if it doesn't is they're fine too right so if you have the wealth element in your chart your wealth is important to you because your chart is your destiny Right, it's your life. If you have the wealth element there, which means that you're willing to do more, right, to make money. Yeah, this is important. Yeah, don't you think your priority is important? You're willing to do more, right? If your wealth element is not in the chart, uh, okay, if it's take too much effort, you don't do it because it's not important anyway for you. Okay, all right. Now, uh, the next one here is uh, if you have the wealth element, you are more pragmatic. Uh, what do I mean pragmatic? Pragmatic means you're a practical person. Right? Yeah, you, if someone, if you know what is important, what is not important, you know who to talk to, right? You're going to spend your time doing the important things, right? If, you are, if they discover something is non-value, they won't waste too much time talking to you. Yeah, so they are more pragmatic. That's why they have all these characters, they are normally make, can make money easier. Okay, so far, do you understand or not? I saw some of your questions or you asked about uh, rock wealth uh, that don't, don't ask about other things that I haven't covered, right? So let's focus on wealth element first. Guys, are you guys okay? I saw some of you asked about what how about rock wealth, what about hidden? Don't, don't, don't complicate the things. We're only talking about what? The first point of identifying your wealth energy. So, so far, so cool. Uh, okay, all right. If you are okay so far, you follow with me. Uh, so far, then... Uh, I uh, type the word yes. Yeah, I need to actually set the the I would say the tempo here. Okay, otherwise you go all over the places and some of you might get confused. Okay, there will be other time to learn about other elements. There are so many interesting about parts. Okay, now since we are talking about three things just now, they're able to recognize opportunities. They are wealth is important to them, and they are more pragmatic. So now the next question here is how intense this emotion is. Right, even you have the wealth element, yes, you have these traits, but the intensity will be different for everyone, isn't it? So now I'm going to share with you how do you actually check for the intensity yeah, of the emotion or the traits I just described just now. 
So let me bring back the butter chart. So, so now if you want to check for the intensity of the of those trades, I want you to scroll down here, scroll down the butter chart right to the bottom here. And I want you to look at these five structures. Okay, the five structures. Once you're able to locate these five structures, I want to look at the wealth element. It always at the top. Yeah, of this uh, uh, Pentagon shape here, this radar chart here. So uh, what you need to do here is to check what is the percentage of the wealth element. So for this person, is forty percent. Do you see it here? Forty. All right. So we only look at the beige color, not the purple color diagram. So yes, yeah. If you have wealth element, you're able to recognize opportunities. Yeah, you're more pragmatic. But how intense are uh, those are? Uh, uh, those correct characteristic he, for this person is 40 percent only so it might not be very apparent so now check your chart okay yeah what how intense your wealth uh trade is check now okay all right once you once you discover the percentage type in the chat box so i can see or I can ensure that you understand. If you're okay, source of your 20, yeah, 20 means that uh, not that intense. Yeah, probably you just want it when it's convenient. But if you are 70% and beyond, yeah, so you're going to actually, you really need to do a lot yeah, to get it. Yeah, so that's why the chances of them to make more money is higher because they like to control a lot of stuff. Okay, so if you discover that your wealth element is 70 percent and above you also discover that you're a very controlling person as well okay yeah because it's all about opportunities you want to make things happen right so you want to be in charge right you want to control stuff not only on your on your not only on your wealth side yeah in every aspect in your life especially your 70 percent is the borderline but if you're 100 percent sure you're already controlling even though you might not think yourself as one ask your one all those people that are around you right so this is the path uh, the intensity of the wealth element okay all right so far is it interesting to learn about wealth aspect from your partner yeah this is just module number one right later on we have more to uncover here yeah, but just to ensure that all of you here yeah understand so far do you understand yeah what we go through right now yeah okay all right great if you understand let me share with you uh i want to bring uh one more level deeper so you can get more from reading the chart so now if you look at the butter chart there's always one thing called the luck pillar all right the luck pillar is here Luck pillar is nothing more than the phases of your life or the cycle of life. So each cycle consists of 10 years or a decade, if you will. So for this person, currently, he's on this cycle. Okay, it's highlighted. So now, I want you to look back at your own partner chart and look at the current cycle you're in. So there will be a word here. Yeah, it's too hard to miss. Okay, it's highlighted in in uh, yellow color anyway. The whole pillars. Okay, so now this cycle is is ten years, and and for this person, it will change to the next cycle when the age hits 40, 41 for this person, right? So for now, this person is still at this pillar here. So now, why I want to bring to this pillar? Because some of you here, you don't have wealth element, right? But do you find? any iw or dw in this column or not so either at the top okay let me just clear this so either at the top here or at the bottom only two part okay for this person of course this person have one you see here so by seeing this we can say that this person going through wealth luck yeah so a lot of people ask right am i going through wealth luck right now so if you have it here means that the luck you're going through you are you're going to make sure you're going to uh, put a lot of effort learn upgrade yourself to make more money 
Okay, so it doesn't matter at top or at the bottom. It's, it's under your current lock pillar means it's, uh, it's there already. So now, what does it mean? It means that if you have it in your current lock pillar, these are the times suddenly you feel that money is important to you. Maybe before this cycle, yeah, you don't even care about investment, you don't care about money management. But when you get into the current cycle that have wealth element, yeah, be it uh, IW or DW, it means that suddenly you have such awakening, you discover, hey, I, I need to do something about it. Right? I need to manage my finance, I need to do investment, I need to make more money, I need to plan for the future. Right? If you have it as it's it's sort of like that is your new priority in life. Okay. All right. Yeah. So wealth opportunities. So a lot of people think, oh, if I go through wealth love, is it means I go to be rich? No. <laughs> a lot of people like to think like that, right? It just says that you're going through wealth love means there's opportunities in terms of wealth. But can you screw up an opportunities or not? Is it possible? Yes. Right. Yeah. Some people got greedy. Some people gamble. Right, so they lost everything. So I don't want you to have a notion that if I go through wealth, love means I'm going to be wealthy. All right, not necessary. It's just telling you wealth opportunities is that because right now your mind, your internal reference that money is important is sort of like you awakened that you need to do something about it. Okay, yeah, this is the power of the lock pillar. Right, let's say you don't have it here. Let's say, let's say, right, you're not, you don't have it in your current lock pillar right now. Do you, how about the next one? Because eventually you're going to move on to the next one, right? Do you see any wealth element? Yeah, check right now. Yeah, maybe current lock cycle you don't have, right? Probably the next one. Yeah, this is how we use Parser to plan ahead. Yeah, what to do next. Okay. All right. So this is how it works. So you can plan. Of course, there are so many other characters. Now we just focus on IW or DW. Okay, because each character have different strategy. How many of you here are, will go through a wealth luck on the next cycle? Then you should get prepared, right? Yeah, though a lot of wealth opportunities is coming. Yeah, it, then how do you prepare? Learn more, right? Upgrade your skill. Yeah, prepare for those opportunities. Okay, great. Wow, so many of you are going through wealth luck. Yeah, so you learn something new here. Yeah, this is the power. Uh, the first step here is to identify your wealth energy in the chart. Okay, all right, great. Oh, so many of you here are uh, fine. Uh, so many of you understand this. Great. It shows me that all of you here are smart uh, people. Yeah, you can understand this by just uh, one round here. That's great. That's great. All right, so shall we move on? All right, there are so many things I'm going to cover today. And especially the last part is very powerful, right? Stay through the end. So now, the second part I'm going to talk about here, the next method of uh, knowing parts, because some of you just now um, uh, look at your chart about the wealth energy. Some of you don't have. Don't worry, right? Continue to listen. Yeah, there's always something you can use along the way. All right. So now the second one I'm going to talk about today is this. The second method is your wealth source. Okay. So and um, the wealth source means that this is to answer uh, the questions that where my wealth coming from. How many of you here want to know the wealth source? Uh, because if you want to make more money. Don't you think it's important to know where is your wealth coming from? If you know it, you then you can position yourself to that direction or that environment to create more wealth. Right? Make sense? Okay. All right. So now take out your butter chart again. I'm going to show you how to do this. Okay. Let me just uh, get my butter chart ready as well from my side. Okay. Let me share this. Okay, so now, uh, in order to do this, now we're talking about where our wealth coming from, right? Our wealth source, where the wealth flow from. So now, in the butter chart, if you pay attention, there are four pillars. There are year pillar, 
there are month pillar, there are day, and there's hour, right? So a pillar means the whole block here. So if I mention year pillar, this is the year pillar, okay? So when I mention month pillar, uh, this whole block is the month pillar. And so do if I mention day pillar, this is the day pillar. And if I mention uh, our pillar, this one is our pillar, the whole block. So there are total of uh, four pillar. Yeah, for beginner, you just need to look at the four pillar. But if you're expert uh, uh, level, there are total of seven pillars, right? So let me just tell you straight away. Year pillar, month pillar, day pillar, hour pillar, your luck pillar, also one pillar, total of five. And then the life palace is another pillar. And then conception palace is another pillar. So total will be seven pillars in total. If you want to study complete parts, there are total of seven pillars. So for today's discussion, I'm going to focus on the four pillars first, right? Because this is the core of it. So now, now I want to actually uh, make this, divide this into two sections. I just draw a line here. Okay, so the year, the year and the month will be one group. And where else the hour and the day will be one group. Are you guys okay? Clear so far? So I group it into one category. So the year and month group, I will just call this external. External. And the day and the hour, I'm going to call this internal. I just group it into two categories. So now, remember we talk about wealth source, right? Where the wealth coming from. So now, let's do this exercise together here all right so now if you see here if your wealth element for this person this is dw right this is the wealth element here and there's another wealth element here so if your wealth element resides in the internal group so either in the day or the hour that's called internal right so if your wealth let's say for this person also you see a wealth here in the external group as well so this person have wealth element in the internal and external so now there are only four possibility either you have none if you don't have any wealth element you have none or either the second one either in the internal group or the third one will be on the external group and the finally will be at both so which means that you have it at both the internal and the external group so type in the chat box so there are only four possibilities, right? None, internal, external, or both. Type in the chat box. Okay, all right. Yeah, so the, remember, our goal here is to identify uh, the, the wealth sources here. All right, great. So I, I think everyone uh, know how to actually uh, extract this information. So now let me tell you what does it mean, right? Okay. So if if your wealth element come from external, so if you want to make more money, you want to gen, you want to actually position yourself where more wealth opportunities are. I would say that if you're in an external group you can uh, you find those opportunities when you work for big companies right big companies or mnc right international company global company uh, or environment yeah the big companies and also social media yeah nowadays right a lot of people want to become kol or influencer right so you have it either in the external external means either in the month pillar or the year pillar then you have these opportunities there you have great opportunities if you want to be let's say you want to be you want to make a lot of money through uh, becoming an influencer in social media maybe you want to be a celebrity in instagram so if you have it in the year or the month pillar then you see more opportunities because it's external, uh, it's public, public money. Okay, we're talking about IPO, it's also belong to this. Okay, external group. And if your wealth element is in the internal, so either is the, is the day or the hour pillar, 
Yeah, then, uh, then there you your money come from what? Since the external is big business, the internal will be a small businesses. Yeah, so but you don't think small business doesn't make more uh doesn't doesn't mean they cannot make more money. Sometimes small company can make more money because they're flexible, right? Their operating cost is low. So therefore, small business, local business, you belong to the internal or independent business, like indie business or freelance. Right. So how many of you here want to be a freelance, right? Or you work as an individual. Then if you if you part of the day and the hour, then it'll be a great one. Like a butter coach. Like for me, yeah, I if I'm a coach, don't you think I'm a I'm a, I work as individual, as one person, as an advisor. So how many of you here you intend to become a coach? Yeah, like something I'm doing, right? I I, I actually do consultation. So as a coach, then therefore uh internal will be the one okay all right so someone also asked josephine Chia asked can it be investor yes of course right investor you're doing this uh, by yourself you are a trader that one is internal yeah that's where you you see a lot of opportunities from okay is this information important yes of course right it able to set you uh, at least you can make the right direction you cannot change your destiny overnight of course but you can change your direction overnight. Okay, so you can know how to maneuver with this. Okay, so now are you clear? And now you see how easy to look for information in the part and how can it just turn your life around like this? Yeah, can you just you can also share this information with your family, right? It's not that hard, right? To, to actually learn this. So maybe later on, you can actually look into that as well. So now, just now internal as a coach, right? You can do internal, but what if I actually doing teaching? I, I, I have students around the world. Let's say you want to teach like a thousand groups of people, right? So is it internal or external? Yeah, let's, let's do one uh, exercise here. Yeah, because as a consultant, I meet people one-to-one, -one, right? So, you know, it's a private consultation, but another part of me, I'm also a teacher. So yeah, I teach like uh, sometimes to thousands of people, you know, depends on uh, the event. Yeah, like today we, uh, we have a few hundreds of people. Yes, therefore it's external. Okay, great. So now if your wealth element is in both categories, you are in internal and external as well, then you can choose both. Okay, so now let me bring back uh, this chart here. Okay, so now for this person, don't you think the wealth element appear in internal and external as, as well, right? So this person have a choice. So can do the, something related to external or internal. But let's say this person insists that he need to only do one. Which one you would choose for this person? Is it internal or external? Which one? Let's say he insists that only can I only want one. You better decide this for me. Okay, all right. Internal, right? Yes, correct. Why? Very easy. Because internal, you have one and two element. Okay. Yeah, this one only have one. So it's a pretty straight um, answer here. So for this person, if you really want to choose one, then I'll say might as well go for internal. Okay, clear? Yeah, this is to address some of your question you asked me just now, right? If I both, then which one should I choose, right? So I hope that this way it can help you to actually choose the uh, uh, the uh, the which one you should do more. Okay, all right, great. So this is the one. Okay, Bohau asked if is a uh, or Brian asked if it's both the same, then you do either one. All right, just decide. <laughs> okay. All right, cool. So now uh, this one is uh, the this one is to help you. Yeah, the technique here is to help you to actually identify yeah where your wealth are uh, coming from. Okay, so now uh, just now just now we talk about the first one is about your wealth energy. We talk about it, and then the second one we talk about is where the wealth source coming from. Yeah, these are the two techniques so far that we have learned today. Okay, so now, 
now the next question here is is by just doing this merely these two things alone you know uh would it means that i go to see more wealth not yet okay because this one's just talking about what opportunities right when you start something or start a business or start a side gig or anything and by the way right if you're talking about how many of you here want to actually uh create a side gig or you have a plan to do a part-time job uh next year how many of you here want to do that you want to be something like a coach where you can guide people how to actually uh, uh maneuver their life okay so many so if you want to be yeah, you can become a puzzle coach by learning puzzle techniques so uh, why why am i telling you this because uh, okay this is side track a little bit here i just want to show you the puzzle chart for next year okay this is the puzzle chart for next year okay there you go hold on okay this is the chart and let me just draw something here give me a sec let me just okay so uh here you you discovered that next year the wealth element the strong wealth element actually appear in the hour pillar okay yeah so it means that what does it mean just now we talk about um the wealth element resides in the hour pillar it means that a lot of people yeah starting next year they want to do their own thing they want to start their own side gigs they want to do something uh, as a coach or freelancer okay so if you're planning to do this yeah then probably partner is one of the uh so-called um a role you can play as a partner coach okay yeah because next year there's a trend you you discover that a lot of people resign and then they start their own thing a more far more mushrooming yeah these are the group of people so therefore it's good for you to plan uh, what you want to do yeah as a side gig for uh next year okay all right so now just now we study two method right? we study two method just now and just now we just talking about you be in the right place or the right environment to create the money but yet it doesn't mean you're going to get the money yeah because you need to have one thing inner strength yeah not intelligence yeah not uh not much about um uh strategy yeah but one thing you must have first is this yeah when you talk about wealth generation i'm going to show you uh this inner strength about persistency don't you think persistency is important right if whatever you have you met someone that say they want to start a business and after three months they don't see result they give up and they always have a great reason to give up of course and then they try something else and have you met someone that keep changing their job every three months their job hopping right so another way uh, they're telling you that they are not persistent enough and if you don't if you don't have this uh persistency uh i would say uh, attributes within you it's very hard for you to create something great in your life Right, you look at all the all the i would say the sports superstar someone that great in what they do right what is the main characteristic that they share persistency right they do training every single day yeah for so many years just to be faster than your other competitor by just milliseconds they're willing to do it right they never give up right failure just motivate them to work harder how many of you here are like that but some people that make use of failure to give up some people make use of failure to work harder yeah if you are persistent enough tell me you already win 50 percent of the battle because most of the people give up agree right after they don't see result after a few months they'll say oh it's not for me or it's not aligned to my partner chart right they just give up like this so therefore i would say that persistency is one of the most important when it talks about wealth generation okay so now the next question here is can we see this persistency uh attributes in our chart of course we can do that okay so now take out your chart again do you want to know this okay great so now there, there are three elements in uh in parts that represent consistency 
right? So, and like for me, I also check also my chart because remember I told you that before that I was struggling financially. I was a programmer that time. And when I when I discovered that I can do something else, I, I, I chose to be a speaker, right? If I don't make that choice during that time, I wouldn't be here today talking about or, or share with you all this information. I'm still writing codes in a little small dark room. <laughs> okay. So, and, and while I changed to the career back seven years ago, be a speaker, don't you think it's an easy move for me or hard? It's really hard, right? Because first of all, as a programmer, you don't need to talk to anyone else except to the monitor screen, right? So as a speaker, you know, stand in front of the stage talking to strangers and further myself as an introvert person, I don't like to stand on stage. Yeah, and then to talk to a lot of people, even to audience in the room freaks me out. That's how uh, scared I am that time. Yeah, it's hard. And but and that yeah, now if you see it right now, you know, from retrospective, of course you see, oh, you should you should persist, right? But during that time it's really hard for me because I still remember in during those early days when I start after I finish uh, one of those talks and struggling doing that. And then some of the gentlemen pull me aside and say, hey, I, I will say, you're not cut out for this, right? This is not you. Why not you just stick back to your old job, your old profession? And those pe person that give me those advice is someone I respect as well. How would you feel? Yeah, someone just tell you, you know, you're not cut out for this. Yeah, I'm very experienced. I can tell whether someone can teach yeah, from the start. And unfortunately, you're not one of them. You're not. Just give up. It's a waste of time. How would you feel? Is that time? Yeah, I, I nearly give up. Right? Yeah, so it's not only one time, right? So I got all this criticism so many times. So the thing that pulled me through, of course, there are a lot of our support, uh, supportive friends. So and, and another way here, I try to find back the reason to, to, uh, to persevere. Right. And if you have this element in the chart, it make it easier for you. So at that time I checked on my chart, I discovered, hey, I also got this element. Right. So it gave me a, a reason uh, for me to push forward to pull it through. So now let me tell you, let me show you right now. What is this three element is? OK, all right, there you go. OK, so if you sit here, there are three elements. There's a, a Ja, Bing, and Gum. Okay, only these three. So, and uh, this this three element uh, represents uh, uh, persistency, right? Or they don't give up easily. Okay, great. Yeah, so just, just remember, they are Ja, Bing, and Gum. Only three elements. So how do you look for this, right? How do you look for this element? is now I'm going to show you a chart. Okay, so this is a chart here. So the first step, the area you can look for this is on either on the day or the month pillar only. Nowhere else. Okay, either on the day and, uh, and or the month pillar. So now let's do some checking here. This person, do you see a jar here? Yes. Is this one of the persistence Persistency element, yes. All right. So now, do you see a kung here? All right. You see another kung here. So this person have three. So so this person have these traits or not? Will this person give up easily, or we continue to push forward? Yeah. So it's part of him. Right. Naturally, they they are they are willing to actually push themselves harder. They don't give up easily. Okay. All right. So let's do another one here. Let's, uh, so to ensure that everyone understand. Okay. So again, we only look at the month and day only. Okay. Let me repeat. I know as much as you like to look at other pillars to find it. Nah, you're not going to have that. All right. So only two on, on the day or the month. So now if you look at here, so is this person have the ja, the ping and the gun? No. Right. Yeah, so you don't have it. So this person, nah, don't have this. Everyone clear? Okay, let's look at another one. Okay, this one also don't have. Right, you look at here. That do that. Does this chart have the 
uh, Jia Ping and Keng? No. Okay, let's do another one. Okay, how about this? Yes, right? You see it here? You see a Ping here? This is a Ping, right? So do you see a Keng here? So this person got two. So the answer is yes. Okay, if you have a lot, someone say, is it stubborn? Yes, they are more stubborn than anyone else. Okay, Veronica asked this question, right? If I got both in pillars, is it means stubborn? Yes, you're right. The more you have all these elements, the more stubborn you are. And stubborn is not necessarily means bad. Right? A lot of people think stubborn. No, stubborn is good. What if you're stubborn with your dream? It's good. What if you're stubborn with your mission to make impact, to help more people? Yeah, it's good, right? Yeah, so stubborn not necessarily bad. Depends on what you're stubborn uh, of, right? So therefore, this is the one you're going to talk about. Okay, great. So you're going to have this. So if you don't have it, then you need to learn it, right? If you have it, it's become uh, easier for you. So how many of you here like uh, the information that we shared just now, that you learn a lot? Okay, you learn a lot today. There are much more to come. Yeah, just to just break a monotony a little bit here to chat with you, right? So if you learn something today, yeah, type the word yes. Okay, great. Okay, I'm glad that all of you here enjoy yourself. There are much more. We are just touching the tip of an iceberg. Okay. They're so anyway, do you guys like parts or not? Do you like parts? Yeah, I like parts because uh, I always believe that people with the right tools, they're able to change the destiny. Okay, that's why I like parts. And some of you are new here. I saw that and you asked, right? Hey, hey, I was in, yeah, how do I get connected to you where I can I can receive some uh, content with you? If you are new uh, uh, to this, right, I, I would say that you can actually join uh, my Telegram channel. Okay, uh, let me show you that uh, my Telegram channel. This is where I constantly release a uh, new information where you uh, it's free, by the way, you just uh, install the Telegram app and then you just uh, uh, you just go to the link or to scan the QR code. But of course, you don't do it now, of course, right? We are still <laughs> we are still here. Yeah, but later on, you can actually join me here at t.me.iversonofficial so you can actually get connected with me and whenever I have new information, right or anything i can i can share with all of you here okay cool right so this is where you can get connected uh with me okay scan the code and or just take a screenshot first you can do this later on there are a lot, a lot of stuff here the the next one i'm going to share is achievement for the month of uh, uh for the month of october right so it's either tomorrow or day after okay so stay connected uh with me on from here okay great so now this now is about persistency, right? Everything in life that worth to uh, or to pursue is worth doing well. And if you're consistent, you're persistent, I'm sure, right? You're able to create some results yeah, that you wanted. Yeah, because like I told you, 95% of the people give up too quickly. So if you are someone right persistent, you belong to the 5% group. And that alone give you a hell lot of opportunities. Great okay all right nice so now are you ready for the next method okay so now i'm going to show you the next method here is um is about creating creating sustainable wealth yeah this is very important a lot of people keep talking about making money I think all of us here can make some money once in a while in our lifetime, right? Yeah, some of us got lucky, you know, and hit a lottery or something. But is is that one is pure pure luck, right? The great one, the one that able to enjoy a uh, long lasting financial, um, uh, so called standing would be if you able to create sustainable wealth. Don't you think this is important, right? So not about just creating wealth but you must think in a way that creating sustainable so which means that money working hard for you right instead of using your time to make money how many of you here right now you exchange your time for money how many of you here do that 
Like if you're working, right? If you don't, if you stop working, then there are no money coming in because you exchange your time. It's your time. Is your time valuable? Of course it is, right? So while you're young, even you, especially when you're young, right? Your time extremely valuable. So if you just exchange your time with money, you are not making money. You're just exchanging your time, right? So don't you think is we need to find a way to how for us to creating money long term, so we can actually not just working hard for money, but we also make money work hard for us. Okay, so the difference between someone that can make more money compared to someone else is one thing: their ability to see long term. And I'm telling you, most of the people they just see short term, right? To pay the bills in it by the end of the month, right? Hopefully they get bonus three months, right? So therefore, the chart actually also show us the mentality of us. Some of us we are tend to be long term thinker, so they have a plan, right? Okay, I have a money here. I'm going to invest. I'm going to do something with it. Some people just I just want right now. I have money. I just want to spend everything. You know, I just I just want to enjoy life. It's a short term thinking. And most of the time, if you're just you you just enjoy the instant gratification, then very likely you're not going to make a lot of money. Even when you make a lot of money, uh, those money not going to last, right? Somehow you're going to use up everything. Okay. So now, how do we see this in your bar chart? So let me ask you first. Right now, is your yeah is your I would say your mindset? Are you uh do you see yourself as a short term thinker, or you you think more long term? Yeah, if you're short term thinker, you always think about how do I get by by the end of the month? Okay, how do I pay the bills? How do I pay the minimum payment for my credit cards, right? So, and uh, if you're a long-term thinker, you say how much money I can save right now so I can reinvest, so I don't work for money for life, right? Okay. Thanks for being honest. I saw I saw some of you say uh, you're long-term and thinker, a uh, long-term thinker. Some of you are short-term. So let's check from your partner chart, right? Whether which one are more dominant force. So let me show you the slide first. Okay, all right. So do you see it here? Okay, so um, there are two elements. Someone just now asked about rock wealth, right? So if your RW, RW stand for rock wealth. Okay, RW stand for rock wealth. So where else IR stand for indirect resource? Okay, so uh, rock wealth normally they are they, they like to think short term. They like to enjoy first. Okay, save later. Yeah, in their mindset, they think that right. We only live once, right? Enjoy now, right? Why worry? But the long-term thinkers say, okay, yeah, I, I, we need to plan out, right? Because we're not going to work forever. We tend to get old, and when we are old, we have less energy. We need to plan, right? Not only now, but for long term, right? So that one is something got to do with IR. So these two rock wealth stand for R W here, and the IR stand for indirect resource. These two element is partial terminology. Okay, but right now I want you to know RW stand for short term and IR stand for long term. Okay, long term thinker. So now, where can you discover this from your chart? So let me show you a chart again. Uh, let me just uh, show you a chart. Take out your butter chart. So where do you look for this piece of information? You just scroll down, scroll down until here. It's called. Uh, it's stated here ten profile strength. Okay, so I want you to look for two things. Remember, they are IR and RW. So RW stand for rock wealth, right? So rock wealth element, do you see it here? Okay, rock wealth element here, and uh, indirect resource is here. Okay, now tell me. And we only look at the NATO. Yeah, now we start with the NATO first. When you go to advanced level, you can plan for NO. But for now, we just look at the NATO. Tell me, for this person, which one would be more dominant, short term or long term? For this person. Okay. Yeah. So check. 
Yeah, once you once you have it, time. Of course, this one is more because Rockwell right stand for short term. So if you want to help this person, you get this person to plan for long term legacy planning, estate planning, right? So this is important for this person. Okay, let's do another one, just in case. All right, so let's do this. So the only two elements we are interested in right now, rock wealth. You see the rock wealth here? And then indirect resource. Oh my God, this person also rock wealth is a lot. Okay, yeah, so teach this person to do what? Money management, yeah, learn how to invest for long term. Yeah, so there you go. So another one, let's do one more here. Okay, so for this person, rock wealth is here and indirect resource is here. Okay, now work with me. Which one this person tends to think long term or short term? Type in the chat box. <laughs> okay, yeah, let's let's do this together. Okay, long term, right? Yeah, so 75%. Okay, easy, right? So uh, what's the point of this exercise is once you know this, you're more aware so you can take different action. Agree? So the chart is not like predestined. You're going to stay like this forever. Your destiny start to change when you have awareness. You might need to write this down. Yeah, the exercise that I did with you just now is to help you to aware yeah, what you're born with. Remember the live user manual and why you want to aware of it so you can change because awareness is the first step to change. You cannot solve a problem if you don't know what is the problem in the first place, right? If you look at Warren Buffett chart, the indirect resource is very strong. So that's why you see he's he doing what? His style is a value investing, right? Yeah, so follow Warren Buffett way to do it. Okay, guys, are you guys clear on this? Okay, all right, cool. So that, that is something you can work. So I, I give you a lot of information today, right? So you want to write down and what's the action plan you can do. That's how you can make yourself become better and better, become a better person. Okay, all right. Okay, do you want more information? Do you want more information? Okay, so now the information I'm going to show you right now is the, is the secrets of, of wealth generation. Yeah, the most powerful one that I learned uh, from some of my mentors and the discovery from the parts. Uh, I show I want you to pay attention to this. Uh, uh, I will say you pay attention to this because this is if you forget everything else, remember the next thing I'm going to tell you. Right, I'm going to tell you right now. Okay, so let me show on the screen here. Okay, is this you? become wealth okay you might not know what it is yet yeah just just uh try to listen first all right so what does it mean by you become wealth so let me explain to you yeah what does it mean you become wealth yeah it's, it's like this when you become wealth is if how many of you want to make more money of course everyone right who doesn't if you want to make more money you on you were able to make more money if you become better right if you want to be a better manager you only can become a better manager if you become better agree if you want to be a better father the way you become a better father when you become better so instead of actually uh, chasing for wealth you become the wealth right so and then i i, I want to share with you a quote here uh, from jay-z yeah, to uh, uh, make my point clearer. Okay, contemplate this. Yeah, this quote is from Jay Z. Yeah, you know he's a very wealthy person, and if you look at this, uh, his quote is, "I'm not a businessman. I am business man." Do you know? Do you see the difference here? Now? What he says. It contains a nugget of wisdom here. How many of you here get the meaning from this? Type the word yes. Okay, type in the chat box. How many of you here get this? <laughs> All right, great. 
So which means that he's not a businessman. He himself is a business. So no matter where he go, he able to generate money because he is the business himself. Okay. All right. Is it profound? Something you learn here, right? You actually become the wealth element. Therefore, you can attract. So that's why a lot of people keep telling me, I want to be a millionaire. How many of you want to become a millionaire? Right? So next time you don't tell yourself you want to become a millionaire. But why? Because when you say you want to become one, basically you are not a millionaire in the first place, right? So therefore you're not going to get it because your mind keep telling yourself you're not. Because if you are, why you say you want to become one, right? So instead of say, I want to become a millionaire, I want you to change your internal conversation to I am a millionaire. Okay, you need to see yourself to be there before you get the results. Yeah, that is the secrets here. Yeah, so and therefore, if you want to as you if you want to achieve anything in the real destiny, right? If you look at this uh this chart here, the the uh the the uh the wealth destiny here, there are so many, right? Remember I asked you about uh, health, about family, right? About wealth, social, spirituality, love, creativity. It's not about strategy to do every single of this. All you need to do is you become a better person. Your inner core is strength. Then all aspects of your life will change. How many of you here see the point here? Yeah, that is the view of uh, the destiny, right? A lot of people focus, oh, I want to focus on health and family. If your inner core right? Your mindset, you're a better person. The rest of it, you become better. How many of you agree with this? Okay, so that's why when we learn Pazza, we want to build up this inner core, right? Because we want to ex expand our influence, our energy to everything else. So uh, that is why people actually uh, learn Pazza. And how do they learn it? So let me tell you, right? 95% when they learn Pazza, most people attempted to change their life with more information without upgrading their inner self. How many of you agree with this? Let me repeat this. Most people attempted to change their destiny with learning more information without upgrading their inner self. So in the end, they just consume a lot, but their life doesn't change. Okay, but the 5% the 5% of it, they actually do it differently, right? They're actually focusing on using Pazza to help them to become a better person, right? To upgrade their inner self. Does it make sense here, right? So this is how I approach uh, Pazza here. And why you want to do this? Because when your inner core, when your inner core is aligned, right? Because it's about your inner core is alignment. So when you actually able to align, then your destiny is flowing. Okay, how many of you here want to align your inner core? Right, it's very important. So therefore, let me ask you, I, I, or maybe a lot of people asking me, how come a lot of people uh, still fail when they're in the right industry? Have you asked yourself this question? Why so many people, people fail when, according to the partner, they're in the right industry? Very simple. You want to know the answer? Because is a wrong person in the right industry. Do you get what I mean here? Right? So you're not the right person. Yeah, maybe mentally you're weak, you're, you're lazy, you have a bad attitude, right? You don't have a progressive mindset. So a wrong person in the right industry, you still feel, you know? Okay? So, and then a lot of people ask, right? How come people still feel even they actually exercise their talent in their, in their partner? Yeah, it's very easy because there's someone else better than you out there. Right? You think you're still unique, is it? Because your child has this talent. Let's say your talent is marketing. Yeah, what makes you think there are no other people in the rest of the world they are also good in marketing? Right? So who is the one that caused it? Still ourselves. Right? How come some people, they, they make a lot of money, but in the end, nothing left in the bank? Because their internal wealth frequency is low. And how many of you here actually meet some people that actually get the same career problems despite keep changing jobs? How many of you have met someone like this before? 
Yeah, even they keep changing job, they get the same problem all the time, right? And they don't know why. Yeah, they they meet uh, uh, the same boss but different name. Almost the same situation. You want to know the reason, right? Because when you change a job, you bring you to the new job. It's still you, right? You still create the same outcome, right? It's nothing to do with the company because you still bring you with you. Yeah. Now, do you see it? Right. So therefore, the next question here is, how do we change this? Yeah, this is the question I asked myself when I tried to get myself out of those financial issues last time. How do I change this? So uh, the solution here is to make a decision to reinvent yourself. Okay, otherwise you're going to run into the same problem over and over again. And the problem here is it gets harder each time. Right, harder each time because you're getting old, right? It's harder. So according to the universal law, you attract by who you become. So my question to you right now is, are you a person that attract great destiny? Yeah, I want you to ask this question, a very honest question right now. Are you a person that attract great destiny? That is the secret. Right? Are you? Yes or no? Only to answer, right? So let's say you aren't, you are not. Your answer is no. Then would you want to become that person or not? The person that to attract great destiny? Of course, right? So, and therefore, once I learned this, I use this pattern yeah, to help myself and my client to facilitate self-transformation, right? How many of you here, you are not only want to learn pattern, you just, but you want to learn pattern that works. There's two difference. A big difference here. Some people just learn pattern, but some people that learn pattern that works, that work for you which means that you want to see real result, not just learning mindlessly, right? Yeah, this is, don't you think this is a, a, a thing that a lot of people are facing? So therefore, yeah, I created, yeah, I created, uh, I compiled all the, do a lot of research based on my experience. I created a new Patser program because a lot of people ask me to teach Patser. So this Patser program, a very unique Patser program on the planet, that focus on one, the most important thing. One most important thing is this, only one, because I think this is the most important thing when you want to actually learn Patser to improve your life. Is a step-by-step -step guide program, guided program for self-transformation, breakthrough and happiness. How many of you here want to learn this? Type the word yes, if you want to know more about this program. Yeah, we only focus on this uh, because we know if you want all your aspect of your life to become better, you need to become better first. Wow, so many of you here. Okay, great. So let me show you uh, uh, more of this because um, this is a new program that I'm going to share with you is something new. It's what I call Ancient Parts Secrets. Okay, it's a one of a kind. It's focusing on getting real results for committed people. Okay, it's a very special program. We call this a Patsa Ancient Secrets. And to make it convenient for everyone here, I decided to conduct this program via live stream. So all of you here are able to enjoy and, and learn this program right at the comfort from your own home. Okay, the date for this is 10 to 11 are uh, December 2022. All right. So these two days is a live stream event. And if you some of you ask, okay, what is the investment for this? If you attended this on in-person event, is the investment cost for self-transformation is 997. Yeah, this is an in-person event. Yeah, but this time we are not going to do an in-person event because if I do an in-person event, yeah, you only can benefit from those that stay in my country, right? I think a lot of you here from overseas. So I decided to do this via live stream. So when I'm doing this via live stream, I can save a lot of cost of the raw hand, uh, rental and all the heavy equipments. So therefore I can pass back the saving for you. Okay, so therefore instead of 997 for this time, because this time I decided to do online. So you can get this for 497. All right, so how many of you here would like to learn this part here? Yeah, to, to uh, 
uh, to help you to reinvent yourself in the new world, in the post-pandemic world. Okay, type the word yes. Yeah, if you want to know more about this, let me show you the step to reinvent yourself. Okay, so now the first step here inside this program, because some of you asked, right, what are you going to, talk, uh, what are you going to cover here is I'm going to show you how do you do this. In this program, the first step here, I'm going to show you how to take control of your life. Yeah, the first step is about taking control. What do I mean taking control here is to take full responsibility of what happening to you be it the good thing or bad thing because if you don't take responsibility of everything in your life you start to blame you cannot change your life make sense so the first step is about taking control so therefore i'm going to show you uh how to master the two forces that shape your destiny yeah, that's the first step so the first one is inner self-mastery because i always believe that the hardest task is to win over ourselves right so in the inner self mastery module i'm going to talk about how to identify invisible forces that stop you from living the life that you deserve right like procrastination anxiety you know how do you use a puzzle pattern interrupt to address all this issue that's stopping you from getting what you want right don't you think this is important okay great so now um, the other forces here is very interesting is do you know that in our life there are seven alternate destiny we can choose from because some of you might ask right how comes people have the same part chart or destiny chart but have different outcome in life it's because the answer is very simple because they have three options seven up to seven options to choose from so which means that if you don't like this destiny there's always an alternate destiny path for you so you have the power you have the option to choose again okay so do you like this or not yeah so you need to do you need to master these two forces because if you don't master these forces you cannot make a change so once you're ready yeah once you're able to master this then i'm going to take you to the next step the next step is about just now is about taking control the second step is about life transformation okay and therefore how do we actually transform is by understand the life force alignment and expansion because all of us here we have a life uh, we have a life force right so if your energy level is high everything is possible right if your energy level is low then you know a, a lot of issues so in chinese metaphysics in parts there's uh, there's a way to look into the life force and how do you align and expand to it so let me show you the model here yeah the life force model there's yin and yang okay yin represent uh something you cannot see like fulfillment confidence courage self-esteem love and yang represent achievement something you can see reputation your physical body your luck your nobleman is here okay so let me show you roughly what i'm going to cover in this your life force module first we're going to talk about how to awaken your seeds of greatness yeah identify your inborn greatness and your life story so you you take in what is useful and discard what is not right this is what given to you so do you want to know your seed of greatness or not okay so this is the first thing we'll talk about in your life force so the second one we'll talk about is restore your inner balance and this is about the five elements so when your five element is balanced life happen for you not to you okay yeah so that's that is great right so it's about here and the third thing i got to talk about here is how many of you here want to rediscover your passion your life purpose and happiness using parts yeah i uh because uh i a lot of time uh people actually uh the reason they're not achieving something is not just because uh it's not because of lack of intelligence yeah it's because the lack of clarity the life purpose, the sense of purpose. How about Pazza help you to guide you to the right direction on this? Okay. All right. Interesting. So the next one on the Yang side, now we're talk about the Yang side. Yang side is about achievement. How many of you here want to actually talk, uh, learn about recession proof Pazza, especially in the economic downturn right now? Yeah, here I'm going to talk about how do you address a hidden wealth issue in our Pazza and how do you expand it? Yeah, how do you expand the wealth energy even you don't have the wealth element yeah one of the technique i'm going to show you is the shifting palace technique 
where even you don't have the wealth element, you can turn around your barter. How many of you want to learn this? Okay. All right. So now the next one uh, I've got to talk about here is uh, this is very important is the uh, health and energy activation. Yeah, because I believe that yeah, your health is your wealth, right? So here you to understand your body, body inner energy flow. So and and help you to do this uh, energy trigger point yeah, in your party chart. OK, and then the next one here is how many of you here prefer to have more luck? What if I can show you a luck creation secrets yeah, to restore your winning edge, yeah, to get back in the flow, get back your mojo. Right, so this is where we use a lot of luck pillar and sun sharp butter to help you to get this done here. Right, some sun sharp butter that I selected that is powerful. I'm going to use it here. Okay, sun sharp butter is just a technique. Okay, right. Do you feel that this program worth the value or not, guys? Yeah, this is a very deep way of learning butter. Right, day master is for beginner. Okay. Yeah, so now this is the real result program, right? So it's into a deep transformation. And that's a lot, right? Because if you want to learn something, you learn from the best. What do I mean learn from the best? It's because I extracted the ancient wisdom from the sages. So we call this the ancient wisdom resurrection here. Okay, so then you're going to talk about a lot of uh, ancient top secret technique like light palace, Conception Palace, the most five most powerful auxiliary stars, the Sensha Butter, Shifting Palace Method for Unfair Advantage, and Advanced Five Element Analysis. Wow. This is and this is what all Butter students must know. Yeah, to complete your pursuit of Butter, right? This is something is a missing link to a lot of people. Then this is the time you can do this. All right. And if you want to use this technique that you learn from here to help others of course of course you can do that all right not an issue but first one thing here you must help yourself first to use this otherwise if you cannot help yourself you cannot help others right you cannot inspire others agree okay all right so now and much more and the good thing here is you can benefit even if you are beginner all right, so some of you are beginner, right? You're wondering, can I able to benefit from this? Of course you can, yeah, because this program is geared for results, right? So if you're interested on the result, then this is the program for you. Okay, so now, yeah, I, I only teach this program once, right? If you say that we're able to repeat this program a year after, I don't think so, right? Even it's slightly ready, it's an in-person event, right? So most of the time I don't like to do the same event uh, twice so if you think this is a must attend event in your lifetime which it, should, it is so that it is uh this is the time and then it would be the investment price i'm going to show the link here all right it's joeyup.com slash abs okay so the link will also appear yeah the team will also uh, uh, show the link uh the box in the uh in the offer you can click on the link to enroll yourself right or you can type in the the link here if you look at the chat box there's an offer tab yeah there's an enroll button just click the enroll button and then to enroll and you get this you get yourself into this program okay i'm looking forward to see you on this program here yeah do you like this okay great so now one more thing all right you one more thing here is uh, do you want bonus or not Right, so because I want to do this one, I want to encourage more people to learn this. So you're not only can help yourself, but to help others as well. So to encourage you further, if you going to join us today, we have a today's bonus here going to open right now. And what you get from this is a VIP access to some of my private webinar. Okay, do you want a VIP access? So when I mean uh, VIP access means that it's not for sale. All right, I'm not, not going to sell this uh, thing here. So the bonus for this VIP access will get you into this, right? If How many of you here want to win in 2023? So, and if you want to, if you enroll the ancient parts of secrets, then you get this bonus for free. And this alone is worth 297. It's about five winnings move 
for the year of 2023. Okay, yeah, this is a great one. So, and do you want another bonus beside of this? Okay, yes. Okay, great. So, but this one we only for first 30. The second one, we open the slot again, a fresh 30 slot for this event. And if you belong to the first 30, you're going to get another bonus talking about relationship. How many of you here want to learn how to analyze soulmate in your partner? Yeah, I haven't teach this before. This is the first time. So if you want to learn how to do this part here, I will say that this is a great bonus for you for relationship. Okay. All right. Great. So let me summarize this for you, right? So the main program would be the Patsa Ancient Secret would be on 10 on 11 December. So this one would be uh, 997. And then the first bonus and you get the second bonus total is 1591. So if you enroll today, you get everything. The Ancient Patsa Secrets, which is the main signature program and you get two bonuses as well. The five checkmate moves for the year of 2023 and soulmate analysis using Patsa. Okay. All right. So there you go. Yeah, this is the link. You can grab the program and all the bonus as only for 497. Okay. To make everything affordable. If you already, if you already are uh, enrolled for this, you're going to get this bonus. Don't worry. I, I saw some of you. How many of you already enrolled for this? Type the word me. Okay. All right. If you already enrolled for this, yes, you're going to get these two bonus. It's automatic. That will be part of your, um, your program already. Okay. Great. So now, uh, let me tell you one thing here, right? This is a thing that I always tell people is, um, you don't need a great past to have a great future. Yeah, you have to go through some rough spot right now. I uh, think seems like I cannot get better. Trust me, I've been there before, right? There's always a way to turn this around, right? I believe that everyone can change their destiny. It have the right to, okay? So your journey to making your best life starts here, okay? So now we go. This is the link. You can go there and, and, and roll for this ancient part of secrets. And you're going to learn a deep, a transformation technique using Patsa. Okay, and you're going to get all these bonuses as well. Okay, all right, great. So this is the this is the um, very I will, I'm look forward for this program because I put a lot of uh, information, uh, pack information that facilitates self transformation. Because I don't see the point of learning a lot of things, but in the end, you don't change. Agree or not, right? There's always a reason why people learn parts or any form of Chinese metaphysics because they want to create a better outcome in life, right? What's the point of just learning just like in a university, right? Just remembering everything, but your life doesn't change, right? Then you wasted all your time and effort. Might as well, you don't learn it, right? So therefore, I look, hey, you know, what can I do to, to actually uh, uh, help people to transform their life? Because I see this works for myself. And I want to actually share the gift to more people as well. Okay. And if you learn this, you also can help other people to change their life as well. Okay. This is how, uh, that's the main reason I conducted this. Okay. Great. So do you enjoy today program? Do you learn a lot uh, from parts today? We just talked a, a tiny part of it about wealth, but you can make a lot of changes already. Right. So I hope you enjoy today sharing. Yeah, I know some of you wake up very late uh, at night, you know, appreciate that. So no matter where you are, I like to express uh, my gratitude yeah, for all of you here spending your precious time to be with me in this two hour session. And of course, I look forward to uh, meet you in person or in our next event, perhaps the Ancient Parts of Secrets, no matter uh, what program. Uh, yeah, if you meet me in person, talk to me, right? Say hi to me. All right, I'd like to meet you in person as well in the near future. Okay, till then, I will say uh, thank you and I wish you nothing but the best. Stay healthy. I'm Iverson. Keep in touch. Bye-bye.